Welcome back, Future Medicos. CMC Vellore has opened its registration for 2024 admission. If you are interested in CMC Vellore, please continue to watch this video. In this video, I will explain to you what is the procedure to apply, who should apply, how many seats are available under the different categories, and which category will you be eligible to apply. I will also discuss about how much is the fee structure, how much is the hostel fees, how much is the application fees, and probably I will also discuss roughly the overall procedure to get a seat in CMC Vellore. Now, you all know that CMC Vellore is one of the top ranked medical colleges in India. It is one of the colleges that is consistently ranked among the top three medical colleges in India. I'm talking about all government medical colleges, private medical colleges, deemed universities, all put together, it is ranking in the top three. Typically, it comes in either second or third. It just comes second to Ames New Delhi. So in case if you are interested to study in a very good medical college, you want good medical education, you should continue to see this video. Particularly Tamil Nadu students, don't miss the opportunity. Tamil Nadu students, there are a lot of benefits because of some reservations that came last year. There are some more reservations for Tamil Nadu students. So Tamil Nadu students should use this opportunity to study in one of the top medical colleges in India. Okay, with that introduction, I will go into the prospectus. I will show you the prospectus and then I will explain how you should apply. So this is the prospectus released today. It is released on 8th February 2024. I just checked in the morning and I could see this uh, admission bulletin. I went through it. I will explain uh, step by step what are the things, important things you should see. Of course, I strongly recommend you to study yourself, read every sentence here. But I will highlight some of the important points that you should take note. The important dates. Application starts today. Of course, now you can start registration with CMC Velour. Of course, who should register? I will talk about it shortly. So 8th February 2024, online application starts. Last date for submission of online applications is 21st March 2024. So it's about one and a half months they have given. So you can register until 21st March 2024. Last date for submission of supporting documents. In case if you have any supporting documents, then you need to send it before 25th March 2024. So you don't need to wait until 21st March in case if you are registering, let's say by 20th February, then immediately you can send your supporting documents if there are supporting documents. Not everyone will have a supporting document. If there are supporting documents, then you can send it. Last date for receipt of certification forms from Minority Network Organization is 11th April 2024. Some of the candidates will be sponsored by the churches or diocese that comes under the CMC Vellore Network. They need to send the forms before 11th April 2024. Once again, this is only for those candidates who are applying under the Minority Network Reservation. They need to send the uh, documents through the sponsoring agency. Now let's look at the seat distribution. If you look at CMC Velo, typically they have two major categories. One is called government quota. The other is called management quota. So government quota, if you look at the government seats, there are 50 seats that come under government quota and then 50 seats come under management quota. Now for the government quota or government seats, only Tamil Nadu students are eligible. Other state students are not eligible for the 50 seats that come under the government quota. Whereas for the management quota, 50 seats, other state students are also eligible, subject to further reservation. Now, first let's focus on the Tamil Nadu reservation. The 50 seats that come under the Tamil Nadu reservation, once again is split into three different categories. There is 20 percentage Christian minority quota. That is 20 seats out of the 50 seats in government quota, 20 seats go to Tamil Nadu Christians. So you should be a Tamil Nadu native plus you should be a Christian. So you should produce nativity certificate. You should produce the religious minority certificate. If you produce both, you will be eligible to get a seat under the state Christian minority quota. That is 20 seats are available. Then the 30 seats which comes under 30% government quota. This again will be split into two. There is a reservation for government school students. 7.5% reservation for government school students. Roughly two to three seats will go to the government school students. 
whereas the remaining 27 to 28 seats is open for all tamil nadu students and within this 27 or 28 students the 69% reservation will apply of course 31% open seats then 26.5% for bc and so on so that reservation exact seat distribution will be known at the time of uh, counseling for tamil nadu but this is the distribution the 50 seats under government seats will go to tamil nadu students two to three seats for tamil nadu government school students 20 seats for tamil nadu christian students then 27 to 28 seats for all tamil nadu students then coming to management quota again there are three categories minority network that is you should be sponsored by one of the diocese and i will show you which diocese or churches are eligible to recommend candidates i will show you later it is in annexure one so you should be recommended by them or in case if you don't find any recommendation then you can directly ask cmc velu to sponsor you if you are a christian so these 38 seats are basically sponsored candidates you should be sponsored by someone then the 10 seats are reserved for cmc velur staff quota the staff who are working with cmc velur for a certain period they can sponsor their child so these 10 seats are mainly for children of cmc velur staff and then finally there are two seats which are considered as open seats these two seats anybody can apply tamil nadu student can apply other state candidates can apply you don't need to be a christian so there is no restriction as far as the open seats are concerned so there are only two open seats anyone who is a non christian and if you don't belong to tamil nadu then you can compete only for the two seats i hope that is clear anyone who is interested only in the government seats that means sir i am from tamil nadu i am interested only in the government seats i am not interested in the management seats then you don't need to apply now it is not needed if you are interested only in government seats that is the 20 seats plus 30 seats you don't need to register now with cmc velur you can directly register with tamil nadu selection committee after neat results but in case if you are interested in the management seats or you are interested both in government seats and management seats then you must register now other state candidates must register now minority network candidates must register now cmc velur staff quota candidates must register now so please remember anyone who is interested in the 50 management seats you should register now as well as you need to register with the tamil nadu selection committee after neat results you need to submit two applications one to cmc velur one to tamil nadu selection committee but if you are a tamil nadu native and you don't want to go under management quota for some reason then you can wait until after the neat results please understand the government seat and management seat as far as the course is concerned there is no difference the fee structure is exactly the same both the fee structure is the same so i don't see why a tamil nadu student should not apply to your management seat and if you are a minority network student probably uh, you can apply to both minority network as well as to tamil nadu state quota if you are from tamil nadu so this is something uh, take note if you have any doubts on this please ask in the comments below i will try to clarify then there is something called eligibility certificate cmc velur comes under tamil nadu dr mgr medical university cmc velur is affiliated to tamil nadu dr mgr medical university so if you are interested in studying in cmc velur then you need to get eligibility certificate from the university now this eligibility certificate is not needed for three board students students from three boards no need to get eligibility certificate who are they tamil nadu state board students need not get the eligibility certificate not needed cbse students not needed cbse students from anywhere you can be from tamil nadu you can be from other state you, can, you, have, you might have studied overseas doesn't matter as long as you have passed the 12th exam in cbse you don't need it then isc or icse students also no need eligibility certificate if you have studied under any other board andhra board karnataka board kerala board you need to get the eligibility certificate from tamil nadu dr mgr medical university you can apply for it online after neat results you need the neat results to apply for it so you can apply after the neat results and if you have studied in any board outside india if you have studied outside india say for example you have studied in singapore or you have studied in hong kong 
under their own curriculum then you need to get a equivalency certificate from association of indian universities so this is needed even before you apply to the eligibility certificate you need to get the equivalency certificate from association of indian universities now where should you apply you should go to admissions.cmcvellur.ac.in go to this website you should be able to follow the procedure and apply now what is the fee structure for application 1200 plus 500 you need to pay 1700 rupees to cmc vellur for this registration and as i told you earlier even though you register with cmc vellur you also must register with tamil nadu selection committee after neat results do so don't forget that uh, you should register with tamil nadu selection committee don't assume that oh i already registered with cmc vellur i have a very good score i will automatically get a seat no even if you have registered with cmc vellur still you need to register with tamil nadu selection committee after neat results please remember that okay there are some details related to the application filling like uh, photo and all you please go through this i'm not going to go through that you can go through i think it's straight forward filling of neat ug 2024 details these are all after neat results once neat results are announced cmc vellur will open the website again and they will ask you to enter the neat score that i we will be coming to know later on right it's not important now similarly uh, filling the tamil nadu management quota rank so after registering with tamil nadu selection committee tamil nadu selection committee will publish a rank list and then you need to enter the rank in cmc vellur uh, this used to be the procedure last year they didn't ask for it the 2.5 they didn't ask you to enter the uh, rank but i don't know again they have put it in the prospectus we don't know they may ask you they may not ask you but you need to follow the procedure after the neat results eligibility certificate i have already explained ug college recommendation for christians or sometimes known as category 62 uh, this is mainly for candidates who are not sponsored by any minority network you are a christian but you could not find any sponsor maybe like your church is not in the minority network list so you cannot get the sponsorship then you can apply for this category 62 or ug college recommendation now you all have to understand that each diocese will get maximum one seat so even though you are coming through a sponsorship don't assume that your seat is guaranteed within your diocese or within your church you should be the top ranked candidate so only one candidate maximum will get why i say maximum because there could be more than 38 churches or diocese normally it is around 42 43 dioceses and there are only 38 seats so some dioceses will even miss out some dioceses may not be able to sponsor if the candidate are having a lower score so neat score will determine which diocese is going to get the seat and within that diocese if you want to get a seat you should be the top ranked candidate once again ug college recommendation the competition is quite high since there is normally only one seat it closes around 650 plus kind of score uh, but if you are interested please apply and give it a try we don't know sometimes the cutoffs may come down and if you are interested in the ug college recommendation what should you do you should fill an aksar 4 later on i will show you an aksar 4 uh, you need to have a certificate from the pastor which is in fact included in an aksar 4 and then you need to attach the baptism or confirmation certificate earlier they used to have an aksar 6 this time there is no an aksar 6 it's only an aksar 4 in the aksar 4 itself they have included the certificate from the pastor so you need to fill three pages of an aksar 4 attach your baptism or confirmation certificate and send it to cmc vellur by post after registration service obligation please remember anyone who is studying in cmc vellur you need to serve for two years whether you are coming under government quota whether you are coming under management quota whether you are coming under minority network quota doesn't matter whichever category you are coming if you are studying in cmc velo you must serve for 2 years now where will you be posted you may be posted in cmc velur main campus you may be posted in cmc rani pet campus you may be posted in cmc chitur campus or if you are coming through minority network you may be sent back to whichever the network is sponsoring you whichever the church or diocese is sponsoring you they you may be sent there and there may be some hospitals associated with that particular diocese and you may have to serve there so it depends on where you are coming from your service may differ which location you are posted but you must serve for 2 years 
these are the documents you need please go through this this is not important right now so i am not going through and then what is the fee structure the fee structure for the first year is 56330 rupees okay how much 56330 rupees this is the same fees for government quota as well as management quota there is no difference in terms of fee structure out of this the tuition fees is only 3000 so from second year onwards you may not be paying 56000 maybe it may come to about 30000 35000 or something like that it will be less than 56000 from second year onwards and then the hostel deposit is 10000 for men 8000 for women so at the time of admission roughly you will be spending somewhere between uh, 65000 to 70000 that will be your expenses at the time of joining and then on a monthly basis the hostel expenses could be somewhere between 6000 to 8000 so roughly you can estimate that the hostel expenses would come to 1 lakh then probably the college fees is about 50000 so 1 and 1/2 lakhs is roughly the cost every year for you to study in cmc vellore of course this does not include your personal expenses book expenses all those are not included purely the college fees and the hostel fees will be roughly around 1 and 1/2 lakhs This is the list of uh, network churches or organizations who may recommend the candidates. That is an extra one. You can check whether your church is available in this list. If it is available in this list, then you can approach your diocese and then try to get a sponsorship letter. Um, then you will be eligible for the minority network seats. But please take note: some of these listed here may not be eligible. Look at the footnote also. A uh, hash dollar. at star all these may not be eligible to sponsor candidates so andhra evangelical lutheran church if you belong to this then you may be eligible for the minority network seat whereas for example there is a hash sign not eligible to recommend to minority network category for admissions 2024 which means arkat lutheran church cannot sponsor the candidate so if you belong to arkat lutheran church then you cannot come through minority network of course you can apply under category 62 which is ug college recommendation for that you can apply and aksher four this is what i said if you are interested in the ug college recommendation that is the one seat that comes under ug college recommendation minority network which will be directly sponsored by cmc velour you can fill an aksher four an aksher four has uh, there are three pages and the third page you need to get the signature of your pastor and then church uh, seal and all and then once you complete the this application form then the three pages along with copy of baptism or conf confirmation certificate you can send it to the registrar christian medical college velour tamil nadu on or before the last date i think the last date was what 25th march right okay look at the table 1.1 and then see what is the last date to send the supporting documents so basically that's it So now I am on the website of CMC Vellore. Uh, the website is admissions.cmcvellore.ac.in. Once you come here, you can see Group A undergraduate degree courses. The first link. So click the first link. That will take you to this page, application form for admissions. So download MBBS Bulletin 2024. This is what just now I have explained to you. Uh, so you can download that. and then you can come to candidate registration so this is the first step you need to do you need to click the candidate registration read whatever the information given here right so the details are here you can go through and then apply online and then you need to enter the details you need to enter your candidate name if there is an initial normally the initial is the first letter of your a father then you can uh, enter male female email address mobile number date of birth and once you do that register and then probably after that they may ask you more details collect the details and submit it so follow the procedure i think it should be straight forward i believe you should be uh, clear now more or less right some of the information which you need probably is available with you and in case something is not clear you need to know a little bit more about cmc velo you can leave your queries in the comments below okay thank you my best wishes to you bye bye